welcome back to my channel, hope you've had a wonderful day. Today's video is about something really, really personal to me and I want to make it a big deal. I'm, I'm not being sponsored, this is just me telling you guys about it, but I want to make it a big deal, make it really well known and more well known to just the beauty community basically. Um, so I heard about this through Pink Parcel. If you haven't heard of Pink Parcel, they are a monthly period subscription box. Um, so they will send you pads, tampons, whatever you choose to cover your monthly period for that month. Um, and recently they have joined the It's Monthly Thing campaign. Um, and if you don't know what that is, then basically it's a campaign that will collect brand new unused sanitary products and distribute them to girls that either can't afford um, femcare products or can't access them um, within the UK. And I think that is such a fantastic cause. It's just incredible. Um, so basically, Pink Parcel are currently sending these prepaid envelopes out monthly. Um, it's got the It's a Monthly Thing um, bit on it in West Byfleet. And you can email Pink Parcel and ask them to send you some of these prepaid envelopes. Um, and they are quite happy to do it. I emailed them a couple of months ago and basically just said, you know, I don't get Pink Parcel because I moved on to a reusable um, menstrual cup. Um, but I really want to be able to donate my products to the campaign is there any chance you can send me some of the um prepaid envelopes and they were really happy they asked me how many i wanted and they actually sent me extra than what i wanted um so i do have some of these envelopes just sitting about um but i just think it's wonderful that you can just send off things that you are never going to use um, to girls that can actually use them and I think that's fantastic. So I am going to read out a couple of facts that are just on this little card that they sent us recently so just so you guys get a bit of an idea of what girls are going through that can't access products that we buy every day um, or every month at least. Um, so it says here one in ten girls in the UK can't afford tampons and pads and we can help. Um, so 27% of girls have used a tampon or a pad for longer than its intended use because they couldn't afford to use a, pre a fresh one, posing potential health risks. Um, so that's actually quite scary for me. Um, I used to be one of those people that would like over change them, so I'd leave them in for like two hours even though it said like you could leave them in for eight. You know, I would, because you know, there's that toxic shock syndrome and it just scared me too much and that's why well part of the reason why I changed to a menstrual cup because there's no risk of that for me um then there's 40 percent of girls in the UK have used toilet roll as a makeshift pad as they can't afford femcare I have actually done that on one occasion um I basically didn't realize that I was coming on it was a complete surprise um so until I was able to get to a shop um, or home, I just rolled up some loo roll and shoved it in there just to sort of, and to, until I could get to a place where I could grab what I needed. But unfortunately, these girls don't have that as an option. So toilet roll is their only option. And I think if we can change that, that's just incredible. And then the last fact on here just says more than 137,000 girls in the UK regularly miss school because they can't afford femcare. So that's actually quite scary that, you know, girls are having to miss out on their education because they can't afford to purchase things that everyone should be able to have. I mean, I personally think, to a certain extent, you know, maybe femcare should be free because, you know, it's not our fault it happens. Everyone, every girl has it. Um... So in some ways, I, I think it's a necessity for life. Um, but obviously that's not the case. So being able to package up things I don't use to send to girls that aren't going to be able to purchase them or get them, you know, it, it's nice that they can actually access these for free because I'm not going to use them. And I don't see the point in chucking them away or just leaving them in a drawer in case I ever use them. It's better to pass them on to somebody that needs them and is going to access them or has the opportunity to access them um so yeah it basically just says collect your unused um tampons and pads pop them in the prepaid envelope 
and then um, yeah, it won't cost you a penny because it's prepaid. Um, so this is also supported by the Bloody Good Period charity, York Road Project, the Red Box Project, and Bin Binti Dignity Period. Um, so that's those there. Oh, sorry, that's those there. So yeah, like I said before, this isn't a sponsored video. Um, I have just collected all the sanitary items that I know I'm not going to use anymore because of my menstrual, menstrual cup. And I intend to package these up and I will pop them in my nearest post box as soon as possible and get them off to these girls that need them. So what I am asking you guys to do is look through those drawers and find things you're never going to use. I mean, for me, these tampons are way too small. Um, so, you know, I knew these have been sitting here for six months maybe and I know I'm not going to use them so there's no point in keeping them so they are going in the bag and it's the same with these tiny little pads I don't need them I'm not going to use them in the bag and this is going to be packaged up and sent off to those girls so I'm asking you to look through your drawers look through your handbags anything you don't use anymore pass on to these girls so that they can have the care they need um yeah that is pretty much what i'm asking you guys to do um like i said you can email pink parcel i will leave a link to their email in the description down below so that you can get them to send you the prepaid envelopes and let me know in the comment section down below whether you've done this whether you think it's a really good idea and you intend to do this just let me know um yeah i hope you enjoyed this video and i hope the facts i gave you were interesting and also like thought provoking and yeah just let me know in the comments down below if you've done this i have packaged off six of these bags so see if you can join me take care and i will see you guys in my next video bye